Good morning and welcome to Michael Waterman Golf. Today we are in Santa Barbara at Sandpiper Golf Course. Uh, a lot of people call it Poor Man's Pebble Beach. Uh, you'll have to make your own decision on that once you see it and definitely get a chance to play it. Uh, not quite sure it's on par with Pebble, but uh, it is a great golf course and coastline is, is just beautiful. Um, so today playing with Steve, Aaron, Josh, Lee, and Avery. And uh, we're going to see what we can do on this back nine. Here we go. Well, it'll work. It's not what I wanted to do. Number 10 is a great hole. Downhill dogleg left par four. You can see where the flag was way down to the left. Big risk reward. If you try and go for it, uh, you'll either come up short in those bunkers left or go through the fairway long which is death that is down to the 11th hole so good hole not a bad view from the uh, 10th green here Number 11, downhill par 3, ah. similar to 7 at Pebble, except at Sandpiper from the gold, it's playing 202 yards. Good line. Go in, I'm thirsty. Not oh, good. Might be long. Oh, shit. Short. Wow. I hit that Up into the wind. My ball was, in fact, so far left it was lost, so I dropped in the rough here and had this Man. downhill pitch over the bunker to the skinny side of the green. goes back up the hill, slight dogleg right, par four. Uh, drivers is a bit risky unless you have complete control of it. Um, you can end up in the left rough or go right of those trees, which is not good. I think I made it up the hill. Close, but not quite. Oh, that's way too much. That was horrible. Horrible and swipey. That's gone. <laughs> oh, another one. Yeah, get one out of the car. Number 13 is a great par five that goes right okay. along the coast. If you hit a good drive, you might have a chance going at it in two. 
Uh, there is another ditch with Barranca between the fairway and the green, so that uh, helps you make your decision depending on where you are driving it up. Well, I did not lose my first tee shot, but then I proceeded to pull the 9-iron down into the ditch. Lost ball. Continuing along the coastline, 14 is a straightaway par 4. Uh, not a tough hole if you hit a good tee shot. And yes, my ball was gone. gone. Alright, let me hit another one. For some reason, I am just throwing everything left. Bunker? Great. Well, I pulled my approach into the greenside bunker and then found out that there's no sand in the bunker. Proceeded to skull my bunker shot over the green into the weeds and then had to pitch back. Dirty putt for Steve. Number 15, long dog leg right par five. Tried to cut the corner here, got a little cute, and ended up in a horrible lie right on the edge of the fairway bunker. Hey, what happened? <laughs> Luckily, I had a stance and was able to get it back in play. Get the fairway. Alright, take a little bit of that.
hole number 16 is a dog leg left par 4. You can see the flag over on the left. I thought I hit my drive through the fairway and got up there and there was a large area of standing water, so I actually had to take a drop in a dry spot. It might be through the fairway though. I was trying to take a little bit left of that and, oh well. You weren't were giving yourself a lot of margin for error. No, I tried to go. Oh, that's short. Fat. Fat city. What? I've been trying to do all day. Nice shot. <laughs> Just hasn't been working that way. Hole number 17, par four, dog leg right. You can see where the oh, wow. fairway yeah, rises back up out of this ditch. It's about a 265 yard carry to get to that flat spot. Yep. Wherever you lost it, found it. That's okay. Good. Still rolling back to the right. Nice. Makes you be fine. Number 18, it's a cute little par three. Um, visually intimidating. You've got the lake, you've got bunker surrounding and false front. So I did not make the green um, and usually a tailwind. So you'd think it would be pretty easy to hit the screen. With a tailwind. Did you get it clean? Oh yeah. Yeah. Huh. Yeah, cause there's the T I hit. Thanks for confusing me. All first. Dry. Yeah. <laughs> See the right distance. Oh my god. Well. Yeah. I think the yard is.
<laughs> yeah, as a part. Camera. I've been all day. That is it for Sandpiper. Uh, not the greatest round today. It's always fun, beautiful course. It's worth coming out to play. Um, but, you know, uh, <laughs> it was a great day and then I decided to play golf. It's one of those. But again, it was fun. Uh, playing with these guys is fun. So uh, we'll get out and try again. See you soon.